Okay, this is the third part of the alarm clock using Python video. So today we are going to add the snooze functionality to our alarm clock. So let's get started. Okay, we are in our computer screen right now. So this is the thing we have written in our previous video. Okay, uh, so today we are going to add the snooze button. So what you have to do is to just write here and elif before that uh, you need to make a variable alarm over okay it will let us know that the alarm is over we can use it like if alarm over equal equals to one then perform a specific function or specific task so when this alarm over will be one when this alarm is over okay at that time only it will be one so here you need to type uh, give a parenthesis now inside it you can type here alarm hour is our first condition for snooze is the alarm hour or the alarm minute should be less than date time dot date time dot now okay just write it here date time dot date time dot now dot hour and write here or alarm uh, minute is less than date time dot date time dot now now dot minute like this okay now after here you need to write here and alarm over equal equals to one give a colons and then here you need to type uh, make a variable snooze actually this will take the input from the user the user wants to snooze or not so just write here snooze uh, like this and in the third brackets just write y slash n so the user will understand he has to give the answer in y or n yes or no okay this will take the input from the user now if snooze equal equals to y or snooze equal equals to the user may write capital y so in that case okay now uh, you need to write here uh, wind sound to play our alarm dot wab okay wab play sound and here alarm dot wab and the flag we are going to use is SND file name okay now after that okay before that it should sleep for uh, two minutes there is a gap of two minutes okay before the before it plays the sound it sh there should be a gap of two minutes for the demo purpose I'm showing you with just 10 10 seconds okay it takes the here 10 seconds it takes it in seconds so if you want two minutes you have to write here 120 in this case I'm writing here just 10 and the sound should repeat uh, around 10 times okay so in this code the sound will repeat only once so it should repeat 10 times so for the demo purpose I'm showing it with just two times okay so for range for i in range 2 just indent it like this and here we have not written our if keyboard dot is pressed uh, shift then it should break we have not written this so let us just write it here like this let me just indent it okay now it has to repeat again and again so you need to add a while true loop like this okay now it's fine now if the user doesn't press y or capital y then what will happen so write here an else and give a colons and since the user has used our 
alarm clock he should he or she should deserve a thanks so just write here thanks and break okay now for this if condition you have to write here and else just write here continue that's it now we have done it let me just check the whole code okay guys we, yeah, i have imported time here so let me just run this code it is asking me the time in hours so let me just enter 7 and it is 59 and it is pm so it is ringing so i'm meeting you after one minute when the time will be just 8 pm so the time is now just 8 pm i'm back and it is asking me to snooze let me just try with y okay let me just try with capital y so it will wait for 10 seconds 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 yeah it ranked. it rang two times again it will uh, ring after 10 seconds okay now let me just press the shift key let's check it's working or not i have pressed the shift key so this while loop has been broken now it is asking me to snooze now if i write here something n or a anything i write here it will break the loop okay it said a thanks and it has broke the loop so this is how it works so we are done with it so guys bye meet you in the above before that before that i have the automate google meet using python video on my left and i have the browser using python video on my right and guys i am ending this series of alarm clock here